The Bishop Guilfoyle football team returned home tonight after a tough overtime loss in their state championship game. Our David Kaplan caught up with the team as they were greeted by the community. He joined us now live in studio with more on their return home. Hi, David. Hi, Amanda. Justin Wheeler, head coach of the Bishop Guilfoyle High School football team, told a group of parents and students today people will be talking about the 2019 team for years to come. AJ Kilmartin plays safety for the Bishop Guilfoyle Marauder football team in Altoona. We're really proud of how far we got, and uh, I mean, even though we fell short, um, we, we had a we had an amazing run, an amazing season, and further than we thought we were going to get at the beginning of the season. They made it to the Class 1A state championship game in Hershey, but Bishop Guilfoyle lost to Farrell High School in overtime, seven to ten. AJ's dad Jim says the turnout of the community at the high school. When the team returned home, shows the players they should hold their heads up high. Today, you know, they didn't come out on the winning end, but uh, they they left it all out on the field, and so it was just such an amazing thing to be able to see the community come together, the team to come together. The team was greeted by fellow classmates, parents, grandparents, and the school's cheer section, the dog pound. Next year, I mean, we gotta work hard to get back to where we were. I mean, this is a great program with great coaches. So I'm sure that um, we'll, we'll get back on top, but um, we got to put a lot of work in the off season. Bishop Guilfoyle has made it to the state championship game four times of the last six years. At the WTAJ studio, David Kaplan, WTAJ News.